This is a Reconstructionist radio production. Narration by Jordan Wilson. Please visit GaryNorth.com slash free books to download this book in PDF format. Conspiracy in Philadelphia, Origins of the United States Constitution by Dr. Gary North. Publisher, Dominion Educational Ministries, Harrisonburg, Virginia. This book is dedicated to the members, living and dead, of Reformed Presbyterian Church of North America, who for over two centuries have smelled a rat in Philadelphia. Appendix D, Freemasons in the American Revolution. This is not an easy topic to sort out. Masonic historians disagree among themselves. Two books deal in detail with this question, one by Ronald Heaton and the other by Philip Roth. Ronald Heaton. The Masonic Service Association published Ronald Heaton's Masonic Membership of the Founding Fathers in 1965. This book contains detailed biographies of about 200 men of the Revolution, of whom about a third were Masons, and a third may have been. And a third may have been. He is judicious in naming the lodges and source documents for attributing membership to anyone. He says that the ten signers of the original Continental Articles of, Asso- of Association were Masons, nine of the signers of the Declaration of Independence, nine of the signers of the Articles of Confederation, thirteen of the, of the signer of the, of the Constitution, 33 general officers of, of the Continental Army, and eight of Washington's 29 aides or military secretaries. His list includes the following men. Thomas Adams, Benedict Arnold, Hodija Baileys, Gunning Bedford Jr., Edward Biddle, John Blair, David Brearley, Jacob Broom, Daniel Carroll, Richard Carey, Richard Caswell, James Clinton, father of DeWitt, Jonathan Dayton, Elias Dayton, John Dickinson, William Ellery, John Fitzgerald, Benjamin Franklin, Joseph Fry, Nicholas Gilman, Mordecai Gist, John Glover, John Greeton, John Hancock, Edward Hand, Cornelius Harnett, Joseph Hughes, James Hogan, William Hooper, Charles Humphreys, David Humphreys, Rufus King, Henry Knox, Lafayette, Henry Lawrence, Benjamin Lincoln, James McHenry, William Maxwell, Hugh Mercer, Richard Montgomery, J.P.G. Muhlenberg, John Nixon, Robert Treat Payne, William Palfrey, Samuel Holden Parsons, John Patterson, William Patterson, Israel Putnam, Rufus Putnam, Edmund Randolph, Peyton Randolph, Daniel Robertow, Arthur St. Clair, Jonathan Bayard Smith, John Stark, Baron von Studen, Richard Stockton, John Sullivan, Jethro Sumner, William Thompson, James Mitchell Varnum, John Walker, George Walton, George Washington, George Whedon, William Whipple, Otho Holland Williams, William Woodford, David Wooster. To this list should be added Joseph Warren and Paul Revere of Boston, whose lodge was closely associated with the Boston Tea Party. James Otis is missing. So is Robert Livingston of New York. So is Paul, John Paul Jones. Above all, so was John Marshall. Philip Roth. Philip A. Roth self-published masonry in the formation of our government in 1727. He was the past master of Henry L. Palmer, Lodge Number 301, and was at the time manager of the Masonic Service Bureau in Washington, D.C. The book provides biographies of key figures in the American Revolution, including English figures, and also includes some brief summaries of key events, such as the inauguration of President, President Washington. W- Roth was judicious. He did not claim that anyone was a Mason unless he could document the actual lodge in which he was a member or was initiated. His list includes the following men. General Benedict Arnold, Colonel William Barton, John Blair, Edmund Burke, British, Richard Caswell, George Clinton, General James Clinton, General Johann de Kalb, General William Davy, General Mordecai Gist, Benjamin Franklin, Nathaniel Green, Richard Gridley, Nathan Hale, Alexander Hamilton, probably, John Hancock, General Edward Hand, Nicholas Herkimer, General James Jackson, John Paul Jones, John Paul Lafayette, Henry Lighthorse Harry Lee, Richard Henry Lee, Morgan Lewis, General Benjamin Lincoln, Robert Livingston, John Marshall, General Hugh Mercer, Jacob Morton, Reverend John Paul Muhlenberg, James Otis, General Sam Parsons, William Pitt, British, General Thomas Proctor, Israel Putnam, Rufus Putnam, Edmund Randolph, Peyton Randolph, Paul Revere, Major General Philip Schuyler, Roger Sherman, probably, General John Stark, 
Baron von Steuburn, General John Sullivan, Joseph Warren, George Washington, General Anthony Wayne, probably, General Otho Williams, and General David Wooster. This audio version of Conspiracy in Philadelphia by Dr. Gary North has been produced by Reconstructionist Radio and narrated by Jordan Wilson. Please visit GaryNorth.com slash free books to download the PDF of this book. The Reconstructionist Radio Podcast Network brings to you a complete lineup of podcasts where you will hear practical and tactical theology. Our desire is not simply that you consume our shows, but that you also live out your faith in every area of life. We can talk all day long about these things, but if we fail to put them into practice, then we fail as ambassadors of Jesus Christ, our King. Subscribe now to your favorite Reconstructionist Radio Podcast Network shows, or you can subscribe to the Reconstructionist Radio Master Feed, where all of the content we produce including the audiobooks and audio articles, will pop up as soon as they are available. And don't forget to visit ReconstructionistRadio.com to volunteer as a narrator or to partner with this ministry financially. May the Holy Spirit stir you into action for Christ and His kingdom.